Welcome back, Wolfpack. Verlus here, and now we're getting into the craziest information from the- WHAT ARE YOU DOING?! What's going on? It's your boy, Danger, back at it with another wacky thing. Now, where am I gonna come from this time? From the hallway? From the drum thing? From the other instrument thing? On a skateboard? Or was I here the whole time? What's going on dudes today? Today we are going to be reviewing God, I gotta turn the fan on, it's so hot in here. Today we're gonna be reviewing these new Pokemon. Now, I have this handy dandy uh, touch screen device that I just ordered. It's from um, Japan, I don't know, it doesn't matter. I don't know how I wanna do this. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do all of them first and then rank them best to worst. That's what we'll do. We gotta stretch it out to 10 minutes. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It's hard times out here for these Poketubers with no news. There's no news for these Poketubers, so we need all the 10 minute videos we can get. Grookey sucks. Hate Grookey. It's just a monkey with a stick, dude. How original. Score Bunny's actually pretty cool. I like the little fast rabbit thing going on, but. Most likely gonna be firefighting, am I right? Am I right, guys? Sobble is obviously the best starter, okay? We've never had a chameleon Pokemon outside of Kecleon, which is completely useless. So I'm very, 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 very excited for Sobble. This is every Twitch emote artist's favorite Pokemon from now on. Any artist on Twitch, any furry, any sort of illustrator, Anyone who has any sort of artistic inclination is going to be drawing this as a buff person, as themselves, as anything. Really cute little puffy, you know, chibi illustrations. This was more fan service than anything else, okay? People love this stuff. If you're not on Twitter, then you wouldn't understand. But if you are, you know exactly what I mean. You know exactly who you are. Gossifleur, I don't know. I don't, I mean, I don't really like the way it looks. I like the idea that it blossoms into this other Eldegoss thing. I just, I don't like the design. I think if Eldegoss is gonna be a thing, it needs to be uh, two stages of evolution. I don't think it should go from Gossifleur straight to Eldegoss. It's just weird. They're both this, relatively the same size. I don't, I don't really like that. Dread, no. Dread, no. Dread, no. I am so freaking excited for this Pokemon. I love turtle Pokemon. To be perfectly honest, let me be honest. With you. I feel like there's way too many turtle Pokemon, okay? I feel like there's way too many turtle Pokemon and we absolutely could do with less turtle Pokemon. But I don't care. I don't care and I think it's great. Tortinator was a bit of a whiff to be perfectly honest. I wish Tortinator was better. It's a cool concept, the dragon and fire, but it sucks competitively unless uh, you do like something like spotlight and then uh, shell trap. But other than that, it's completely useless and I thought that was a big waste because I really enjoyed Turtonator so hopefully this thing honestly it looks like it's gonna be rock grass to me but Corviknight oh boy where all the Reaper mains at huh did you really need another black edgy Pokemon oh man here we go Corviknight everyone loves Corviknight it's so cool brutal dude brutal do we really need these people cosplaying as Corviknight with all the freaking... I'm I'm talking about furries, of course. And then we got the little chipmunk thing. I don't really care about that. Um, it's pretty much going to be Diggersby, but uh, like squirrel thing, right? Am I right? Now we get to Xerneas 2.0. Zacian, Zacian. I really like this Pokemon. Really like the fact that it has a sword. I... 
don't like the colors. I think the legendaries colors should be swapped. Uh, but I like it. I like the ornate headdress. I like everything like that. Uh, and then Zamazenta, same thing. I like the concept. I think the colors don't really do it justice. Um, I think if they were going to make Za Cyan and Za Magenta, I thought I had to burp. The first time in Danger History, nothing came out. I think that they should have just went and made it Cyan and Magenta or whatever. You know what I mean? I think they should have just done it with the gold. So like Magenta and gold and Cyan and gold. And you can do the white accents for filler and stuff like that. But I really like, they both have super duper anime vibes and I really like that. All right, so now, 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 we are going to rate them from best to worst. Here we go. It's time for the thumbnail, boys. Perfect. Best, I'm gonna go ahead and say was Corviknight. And you know why? because everybody loves this one so objectively it is the best okay so I'm gonna say Corviknight right about here okay next I'm gonna say Wooloo Corviknight Wooloo right because everyone loves these then I'm gonna say the turtle one Dreadnought I'm gonna say both of the legendaries, probably, because they're just legendaries, right? So I'm gonna say Zasayan first, and then Zamazenta. Then let's do Sobble and Score Bunny and Grookey way down here. And then not even on the chart are Gossifleur and Eldegoss. Like way down here. They're not even on the chart, okay? They're not, they don't exist. So that's about it. Uh, hopefully this was 10 minutes long or more because I'm gonna have to edit this and I really hope that this is 10 minutes long because I'm really trying to suck out as many videos from this as possible. I think the direct was only like 15 minutes, right? The video that's posted on the channel. So if I can get at least an hour and a half of YouTube videos, uh, you know, I'm gonna be a happy boy. Anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment if you feel so inclined and subscribe to get updates on all of my newest content drops. You guys have been great. Oh, by the way, I'm streaming on weekends only now and then I'm gonna try and do videos throughout the week. I'm not gonna say every day because they take a long time and I work all day long. Anyway, look forward to that. You guys have been great. I have been the Danger Moss and I will see you next time. Bye.